Okay, that's not the button. <laughs> um. <clears throat> that is not the button. No, the hardest. Po okay, welcome back, everybody. If you're watching this on YouTube, it has been a minute since I've uh, played this game. It has genuinely been, like, quite, quite the long time uh, since I've played this game on stream. Hold up. Mr. Godzilla down here is catching my charger. There we go. But yeah, and I honestly don't remember where I where I am or what I'm doing. Oh, okay. Dude, super weird. Wii U gamepad literally lagged. What the fuck? <laughs> when your Wii U gamepad's lagging? Alright. What's up? I don't know where I am or what I'm doing. Hello? Alright. Glad to see we're communicating. I'm glad to see that our relationship is met has reached that level. Excuse me! We are, we are really getting into the depths of this man's mind right now. This isn't working. Maybe he can't hear us. You don't have to yell. I can't. I can hear you, you know. So you guys are on a big adventure in search of the ghost ship, eh? Uh, how'd you know? Humans always think that... Think that unless they say something, others won't hear them. Truth is, people talk just as loudly with their hearts. But because people have mouths, they don't pay attention to their hearts. What the fuck? What kind of nonsense is that? So, what, are you going to tell me that every other animal that has a mouth... Do you not have a mouth, my good sir? There is nothing I have to tell you now, Link. But there will come a day when you acquire my power. It is then that you should pay another visit to Zaz the Blacksmith. Alright, Zaz the Blacksmith. Okay. Moving on. <laughs> Move, moving on. I have no idea what the fuck our man is on about. But I will steal his treasure. I will steal his treasure and then I will leave. I have no problem stealing stuff from him and then just dipping out. Because, I mean, the man's absolutely fucking ignored the hell out of me. That's not as nice. There has to be something hiding in a place like this. Snoop around the island. No, no, we'll snoop around. You said to snoop around, then we shall snoop around, okay? If, if we're supposed to snoop around, then that is what I will do. What is this? Hello? Find the stone tiles on the east and west of this island. Connect the eastern stones with a line. Do the same with the western stones. Dig where the extensions of these two lines intersect. Oh. Oh, okay. That's a little, like... Alright. Um... That's that's one thing. You you take a lot of notes Yo, in this fucking game. What's up, diggity dogs? What's up, guys? I cannot draw a straight line. Don't worry about it. Wait, okay, so there's... Wait, what the fuck? I don't think I understand. I think I'm lost. What is it wanting me to do? <laughs> um, cow punching bitch made assless edgelord bitch. I mean, that's that is quite the title. There's a lot of names in that title. Connect the eastern stones with a line. Do the same. Oh, um, okay. So we got one. So hold up. I need to, I need to fix this. I. I fucked it up. Erase it. Get off my screen. Off my screen. Okay. So, am I am I on it? I am. We need to do box. That's a box. And this is a box. Okay, we got those boxes. Where's the next boxes? Any more boxes or am I losing my mind slowly? Dude, I gotta say, this Zelda game, I, I'm still not used to the, uh, using the stylus to, like, move around. That is probably one of, like, the weirdest things to use for movement, in my opinion. Like, in a game. Like, out... I'm gonna say it's down here? Like, I'm probably wrong. But we're just going to say I'm right and then move on. Like, th that's, you know, this is exactly what's happening. Because last time we did a we did a uh, challenge where I had to dig up stuff, we learned the hard way that uh, 
It is this game is incredibly fucking specific. But I'm also slowly getting rich because I'm just gonna dig up this entire fucking uh, zip code basically until I find whatever it is that I need. Someone's gonna walk over. Edgy gamer, by the way, you're doing this entirely wrong, and you should definitely get better at literally anything else because you're fucking garbage. And you know what? That's okay because right now. I'm the master of digging holes, okay? If you keep talking shit, I'll go do this in your yard. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Honestly, I don't... Ooh, hello? What are you? Treasure map? Yes! Yes! I know where treasure is now! Fuck yeah! Was that what I was, spo was, that what I was supposed to find? I assume so. Alright, hell yeah! West of Loathing. That sounds like a weird name. What type of game is West of Loathing? Is that a strategy game, an adventure game, a shooter game? Um, I mean, I do have my gaming laptop, but to be honest with you, I'm a little scared to stream anything on it. If I do ever stream a game on my laptop, it's going to be a very, um, very not taxing game, basically. Like a very easy on my, uh... What are these X's, by the way? What the fuck are these X's? Uh, I guess. I don't fucking know. And we're off! Onward! To the adventure of a lifetime! Hard turn to port. You know, this would be great if I could draw a straight line. But since I can't, this boat is gonna be rocking back and forth the entire time. That's okay. Is the game too loud, by the way? If the game is too loud, feel free to let me know. Because I don't really have a way of telling. I just more or less, like, you know, don't know. <laughs> Pretty much. Like, if, if the game is, like, way too loud, just let me know. Markiplier's played it? Oh, okay. It's a turn-based game with a bit of strategy, and it's fucking hilarious. Okay, so it's hilarious. I got you. Well, I'm gonna have to check it out then at some point. Since it's, like, a comedic game, I do like my comedic games. I thought that said Banana Island, so that's what I'm gonna call it now. Banana Island. We're, we're gonna... We're gonna go... Banana... Isle. There we go. And we're gonna, like, you know... Draw one. Oop. There we go. Banana Isle. I'm sure you all can read that as my perfect handwriting. I'm not gonna lie, my handwriting is not good, but a stylus makes it ten times harder. Okay, like I have never, I cannot believe how bad that actually looks. <laughs> oh god, you know, this game makes me look like I failed English with a fucking negative E. Okay, let's see. What is hiding in the depths of this cave? What secrets lie? Only those with the power to shatter rock will find the path here. Okay, well, thankfully, I may not have the power to shatter rock, so I have the power to blow up. Is the ultimate power, being able to explode. Can't you, like, blow out torches in this game? No, I guess not. I could have sworn you could. I must be thinking of a different Zelda game. Or I might be thinking of Spirit Tracks. I don't know. You know, I feel like these games would be better if you didn't have to move around with the stylus. I feel like moving around with the stylus is probably one of the more annoying, like, movement choices they could have went with. But, I mean, I can kind of understand, especially them wanting to do something different. I mean, I guess that kind of makes sense, but it's definitely not anything I want to do. Canon game stand? Oh, okay. What's the canon game? So are you going to play or what? Uh, sure, I guess. Yeah, okay. Whoa. Cinematic, bro. Ah, this game of skill takes place on the vast stage of the open sea. Leap on board, prepare to set sail, and raise anchor! On the horizon looms a blue target. Man the cannon. Take aim and kaboom! 
Yo! Sp <laughs> Splarsh Bankaboom. Splarsh Bankaboom. Splar Splarsh Bankaboom. Okay. All right. All right. You obliterate the target, earning 100 points. Does it make the Splarsh Bankaboom sound every time? Suddenly, a red target sails into view. It fears nothing, for it can't be broken. Every time you pound it with cannon fire, you earn 20 points. Blapow! Yes. Yeah, so did you get all that? I mean, kind of? It's a great fucking game. You should, you should if you find it interesting enough, make it your next single player series. I recommend a blind playthrough. Um, I don't know if I'll make that my next single player playthrough. Like I said, I don't like to uh, play games on my PC very much because I fucking hate using... Um, oh, well, f first off, it would be super annoying because I'd have to use, I'd have to put this camera over here. But besides that, I would fucking hate, um, streaming on my computer. I don't know. I just, it's so inconvenient to me. So good luck and all that. So I might, I'll, I'll have to think about it. I don't know if it'd be the next single player playthrough though. Because right now I'm playing this game and I'm playing Demon's Souls. Damn it. Come on. Come on. Honestly, hitting the blues is fucking easy as hell, bro. This shit's just me tapping the fuck out of my screen. On. Here we go, easy. Oh fuck, this bitch moves. Don't let him breathe. Oh fuck. Is he on their other side too? No one told me about this. There we go. Jeez, why are they spinning? Who said you could spin? Sit still so I can blast you. Fuck. Dude, okay, I can only wonder how good I'm doing. Watch me hit like the high score first fucking try. Did I miss a blue? No, I think it's a red. Fuck, the high score was 2,500, you bitch! Not bad, you got 2,360 points. I'll give you a prize for playing. Pick a chest to claim it. I got a wood handrail. Like, is that good? I don't know if that's good or not, but bro, I'm beating this high score. This bitch, this bitch is going down. Ooh, dig your lipstick. Well, thank you, Luna. Thank you. Um, actually, you can use a controller for it. Just Bluetooth your Xbox controller to the PC. I have no idea how to do that either. But, um, I may or may not. Like I said, I, I just do not find it comfortable to stream using a PC at all. Because I don't have a desk, and I don't have a PC. I just have my laptop, and it's sitting on a bunch of cardboard. Which I'm like, I'm 100% I'm not lying. Like, I have a cardboard tower what is what my uh, laptop sits on. Well, I thank you for the comment on my lipstick. We're definitely probably, um... Uh, have you played the game yet, Izzy? Or have you, um... Uh, or have you only really seen playthroughs of it? Come on, I need 2,500, chat. You guys believe in me? Come on. I might go dead silent for this. Ah, 
Oh, I failed. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Hit the bitch. God fucking fucker. Hold up. I can reclaim this. Motherfucker! You debated me, you bitch! How dare you make it to where that fucking blue target was out of range, you asshole! Fuck you! Fuck your ship part, no! Screw you, I'm beating your damn high score! Oh, well, oh, pause the game. West of Loathing is fun, hilarious, and I fucking love playing it. You're in the middle of your playthrough. They honestly need to add West of Loathing to consoles instead of being Steam only. Third time's a charm. <laughs> honestly, at this point, yes. <laughs> I mean, would it be a Zelda playthrough without mini games? Okay, mini games are what makes Zelda what it is. Mini games and weird ass characters. Sorry, this is absolute try-hard mode right now. I'm like the five-year-old who got Ocarina of Time, and I'm trying to beat the stupid bow minigame in Hyrule Castle right now. Come on. This is possible. I just have to believe in myself. Life is a Disney movie. You fucking go, got your ass. Fucking through my phone. <laughs> what? Two thousand seven hundred forty points. That's that's unheard of. You get a prize for cannon excellence. Pick a pick a chest and claim it. I got the bomb bag. I can carry more bombs. Fuck yeah. Oh yeah, you beat your record. Way to go or whatever. You qualify. For for this bonus prize, take it. I got twenty dollars. Uh, okay, it's twenty rupees. Fuck you. You're welcome. <laughs> well, chat. See what I'm. See, you just had to believe in yourself. Life is a Disney movie. <clears throat> oh, you dig the gloves? Well, thank you. Yeah, I have. Uh, I've got my gloves on today. Um, thankfully, these are gloves that don't hinder my ability to play the video game. Um, I usually wear these when I'm wearing my uh, Kylo Ren cowl. Um, but I, uh, cannot really wear that while I'm playing the game comfortably. <sighs> Kerboom! If you can't stream West of Loathing, please watch Mark play it. I know you will fucking love the game. See, you did it. I know- I Izzy believed in me. Yeet. Who did we love? Spend 60 on the game, get 20 back. Nice. Giving me emo- Fuck boy, e-boy. 
Um, yes, don't we know I'm the emo femboy fuckboy? Okay. That's exactly what I am. Now put the put the bombs away. Put the bombs away. Calm down. I have no idea how to get over there, but that is okay. There's more to this island than just a minigame, I'm sure. Out of my way, bats! Keith, you will not catch me. I am not the man bat nor the bat man. Nor am I playing Bloodborne right now, so I don't want any spoopy bullshit. I just want to make my way downtown. Old Wayfarer's house. Okay. Well, hold up. Hold up. Old. Fuck. There we go. I gotta take note, chat. I gotta take note. I gotta make sure that I remember everything, alright? We got the old fuck, we've got the mini game. Wait, what was that word? Ker. Kerbanga boom or whatever the fuck? Oh, dude, I don't even know. Emo fuck boy with a cardboard ass. Edgy gamer, the emo femboy fuck boy with a non existent ass with edge so sharp it cuts his <laughs> face. I dare you to draw a penis on the stream. No. <laughs> I, I'd rather not get myself in any more trouble than I probably already do. Man, my man, my, okay, you can be powerful with the force. This man's powerful with his nose. God damn. He probably can part the seas with just his nose. Oh, this is the place for those who hunger for the romance of adventure. Whoops. This is the way, Faring Island, young man. <laughs> so, go on, tell me. Did you find it? It? Hey, now, you can you can tell me. There are no secrets between me of a men of adventure. You came to this distant island in search of the elusive beast. The mystical creature that bewitches sailors from the waters of the island. You came in search of the mythical mermaid, right? Huh? What? Wayfarers must always be looking for adventure. In my search for the mystical creature, the mermaid, I sacrificed many of life's pleasures, friends, family, good snacks. I've not had Doritos in years. I gave it all up to search for the mermaid. Take this pool, for example. Why do you have a pool? That's where the majestic creature will lounge once I capture her. This pool cost a hefty fortune for a man who follows his wayfaring heart. You are young with age. I have learned to approach life's quest with passion. So, young man, if you see a mermaid, you'll tell me right away, won't you? We men of adventure must stick together. All right. So my man's is looking for a mermaid. Um, okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm ready to set sail. <laughs> I don't think I need to be here anymore. I could have sworn this is where I needed to be, but apparently I was wrong. Yeah, did you draw... How hard can it be to draw Dylan? I feel like someone could make a hot dilf out of, the, out of this dude. Does this count as kidnapping? It probably does. Uh, Isle of Gust. Isn't that where we need to go? I think that's where we need to go, right? And we're off to an adventure! God, I'm pasty as fuck. Look at that shit. Oh my god. God damn. Yar! Um... Mermaid. There we go. That's what I'll do. Apparently they need a mermaid, so... You motherfucker! Dude! Fuck off! How many bombs do you need to be satisfied? What the fuck? What the hell? What the fuck is going on? Oh my god, kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Get away from the tornadoes, get away from the bombs! 
Yo mama! Oh shit! I don't remember how to get through this island. What the fuck do I do? Beware of great winds. Did I not... Have I been here already? Now I'm just confused! Gremlins, can you stop? Can you, can you come back when I'm not trying to figure out what the fuck's going on? Alright. There we go. I was waiting for the wind to immediately blow as soon as I jumped. That would have been the biggest gotcha moment for the game. The game would have absolutely got me. Yeah, here we go. What is this? What's in here? What the fuck is in here? There's gotta be something in here, right? Wait a second. No, not that button. Is it this button? What have I... So I got... I'm very confused. I think I've already been here, but I don't really know. Is this the second island I need to go to, or is this the third? Oh, dude, I blocked the fuck out of him. See, I'm a lot more accustomed to games like Twilight Princess, you know, the easier games. The These, like, freaking uh, DS games, I have no idea, bro. This shit starts eluding the hell out of me. Like, I just don't understand. I don't have the brain power to know what's happening. I mean, to be fair, I've also not played recently. So, like, we might low-key look on my YouTube midstream to figure out where the fuck I was last. That honestly might not be a bad idea. Like, I don't know, what would, what would chat think if I looked on my YouTube to figure out where we were last? Do you... Do you think do you think that's cheating or is that like totally fair game? Do I need to remember where I am at all times? Let's go to YouTube. Let's go to YouTube. We 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 have no idea where we're at or what we're doing. So let's 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 go ahead and YouTube it. Plot twist, Haven's been a vampire the whole time. I honestly might be. Like at this point, I just might be. Sorry, someone sent me a picture of a dog and I have to Tell them how adorable it is. It's, uh, I know somebody who has a Yorkie, and I fucking love that dog. That dog is like my child, but he's not my child, and I also don't own him in any way. But he's like my child. I'm like the step that, I'm like a, I'm like his stepfather that's, or I'm like his real father that's never there, but I show up and then bring him gifts, and then I have to leave. You know, it's kind of, it's like that. Like, I don't pay for him. I don't do anything, but I just appear out of nowhere, give him gifts, Give him attention and then leave. I'm like his. I'm like his real father. It's fantastic. Um, if this mermaid seduces sailors, then he's actually hunting a siren. We need a Majora's Mask stream. Oh, dude, I fucking love Majora's Mask. Majora's Mask is fantastic. Majora's Mask is a great time. Okay, so here we go. So last time I played, it was for an hour and twenty-two minutes. So what the fuck was I doing last time? Okay, so I think I beat the Isle of Gus last time. So I need to go back to the, uh... I think I need to go back to the... Yeah, I was exploring. That's what I was doing. So, I've already beaten this island. We don't need to be here. Give it... Give it back! Give it back! Thank you. Gus, you... Can I not, I was going to say, can I not just jump backwards, or am I going to have to go the whole way? I think I have to go all the way. He's going all the way! Actually, wait, can I just jump down here? Nope. All right. Fantastic. Come on, work with me, wind! There we go. Can I jump down right here? Yes, I can! And that is how the edgy gamer avoided redoing an island again. Because he absolutely was about to. So we need to go all the way back to the big, uh, the water place. Or no, the temple. There we go, the big temple. But yeah, uh, Majora's Mask, I love that game. Majora's Mask is a really, really good Zelda game. Um, I feel like most people who've played Zelda 
probably have some type of fond memory with uh, Majora's Mask. Because I feel like Majora's Mask, it's just a fantastic Zelda game. Like, I will say it's a very different Zelda game, so I could I can understand. I, I hit stop. I hit fucking stop, you bitch. God damn it. gonna stop right here. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> Perfect. Onward! Starboard bound! Fuck you. You didn't have to do this. Like, no one said you had to, but you did it anyways. Um, anyways, uh, your five Legends Zelda games are sc Oh. Wait, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. My life is on the line. My life is on the line. My life is on the line. We cannot lose. Yar. Land ho. And yes, I mean your mother. Look. Listen. Your um five. Your five Legend of Zelda games are Skyward Sword, Twilight Princess, Breath of the Wild, Majora's Mask, and Spirit Track. So you've never played. Um, Ocarina of Time, you should absolutely play Ocarina of Time, Izzy. I feel like you'd like that game. It's a pretty good Zelda game. It's definitely overhyped, but it's still a good game. Like, even if it is 100% overhyped all to hell, it is definitely a game that is worth playing, I would say. Link to the Past was both your first Zelda game, but was also your first ever video game. Um, I think I told you guys, too, that, like, a Wind Waker was my first ever Zelda game. Or, and first ever video game as well. So I can kind of relate to you on that as, a, as your first video game. What the fuck is this island? What? Look at the upper screen break fourth wall. There's no map on this island. That means no one's even set foot here. Think of all the undiscovered treasure. Doesn't make sense. How could there be if there, no one's been here before? Maybe someone who knows diddly about treasure... I'm buried something. Bah, whatever. I just know that there's treasure here, Link. I sniffed it out. Now you go find it, maybe around the middle of the island. So, what I need to do... Is we need to draw this island. Because I know for... I, this is the last island I did when I played the game last. You motherfucker. I immediately dove face first into the ocean. But yeah, you're supposed to uh, draw this. Okay, so what is going on here? Bro. Alrighty then. You know, this is looking really fucking weird, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, this shit looks super weird, bro. I really don't know how to feel about it right now. What the fuck is this? What is this supposed to be? It looks like a palm tree. <laughs> Chat, I'm sure you're impr impressed with my drawing skills, and I want you to know that you should be impressed with my drawing skills. I want you guys to know I'm probably one of the best artists on... on Twitch, by far. You've never met anyone with my level of artistry. Oh my god. Also, you never met someone with my level of skill at uh, handheld Zelda games. As I tap, as my uh, tap to skill adventure. Is this a whale? Bro, this literally looks like a whale. Hold up. Dude, it's totally a whale. That's exactly what it is. I beat Ocarina, or however it's spelled. It takes spot six. Oh, that's your top five. 
I don't know why, but I thought that was like the only five you've played. That's what I was taking that as. It's like the only five that you've played. My bad, my bad. Yeah, this is definitely a whale. This is one of the few Zelda games out there that I've never beaten, by the way, for anyone who is curious. Like, I've, I've literally never beaten this game. Played. So what the fuck is this? What the hell is this part supposed to be? Oh, is that the flipper? Oh my god, it's literally a whale! And I'm literally drowning. I mean, I'm kind of walking off. Okay, hold up. Let me fix that. There we go. That's that's pretty accurate, I would say. Um, what the fuck is this? Oh, this is his eyes? <laughs> okay. This seems a little weird, but okay. <laughs> Dude, Zelda is your number one video game series in the world. You played nearly every Zelda game out there. Is there a certain Zelda game that you've never played? I think you said you never played the Four Swords games, right? There we go. He's happy, chat. He's very happy. Actually, hold up, hold up. Hold up, hold up. He's an edgy whale. He's got the eyeliner. He's got the, uh... The lip ring. He's got, like, um, you know, the freaking, uh, the emo hair. Hold up. Hold up, chat. We're making an emo whale together. There we go. And then he's got like a, uh, you know, he's got like pants on or whatever. He's got like a shirt. And like it says, uh, MCR. <laughs> oh my god. I fucking love it. I fucking love it. Hold up. Um, what else can I put on him? What else can I put on him? He's got a lip ring. He's got the eyeliner. He's got the hair. What else does he need? Chat, what does he need? What he's got the edgy band shirt. All right. What el what else would an edgy whale have? Hmm. <laughs> um hmm. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Fingerless gloves and black nail polish. Um Hold up, we're gonna, we're gonna do this. Yep. Black nail polish. He's got little, like, gloves on. There we go. There we go. That's, that's what we got. And, oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. He's You're not that guy, pal, trust me. You're not that guy. I'm not that guy? Hold up, he's got the... He's got the pants on, and he's got, like, uh, you know, ripped pants. There we go. And hold up. Um. Hold up. <laughs> 
Hold up, mom doesn't understand. Yep, there we go. That's we we know what it says. We know what it says. And then we've got like a single tier. Like a single salty tier. There we go. There's my emo whale. I hope you're all proud of me. <laughs> it's called Emo Whale Island. I fucking love it. Um Hold up, uh somebody asked me something. Uh okay. Let's see here. Yoing on this isle. A golden chief dwells who can harness the power of sea cyclones. At his request, I am here to prevent just anyone from entering his chamber. You must prove yourself by hitting four of my buddies in a very specific order. But to figure out the order, you must solve our island's enormous riddle. Ready to listen? The order is very specific. Okay, then. I'm going to say it. It steers with rudder, then makes spray. And third, it paddles and sees away. Wait, okay. Rudder? Say that again? So, it is rudder, spray, paddles, and seas. Okay. Well, thankfully, since I did such a bang-up job marking everything, I don't have to worry about any of that. I'm so- I'm just so good at the game. Did you know there are gold frogs around the sea that can kick up cyclones? I did not fucking know that. What? Alright. Seems a little random, but okay. Yeah, it said rudders, and then it said spray, which should be, like, way the fuck out here. Did you know there are six golden frogs stationed around the entire sea? That's even more random. What the fuck? What are we on about right now? What are, what are we talking about? Did you know the golden frogs will slip away unless you are on it? You hit a cannon on them? I mean, that's cool. Why do I care? <laughs> Did you know you can fly to a variety of spots using cyclones? So convenient, not that it matters to us, really. Frog hunt time! Hold up. Absolutely fucking played! There we go. No one stands away- stands in my way. I know this island like the back of my hand. I fucking drew this island, damn it! I know it. I know the whole place. Um... Let's see here. Uh, I have no idea what I'm doing. You have to... The eye sees something valuable that's hidden underneath its statue. I love cryptic messaging, by the way. It's my favorite type of messaging. It is the only way to deliver messages, by the way. Because you know mom and dad truly wouldn't understand. <laughs> um, okay. Get some milk. You know, um... I will say while I'm fixing something right here. The one thing about me drinking milk while I'm streaming is that the worst part is it does it actually messes up my voice cuz since I'm not drinking any water and I'm just drinking milk, it should honestly I should change the name to e Emo Whale Island. I actually should do that. Um, you know what? That's actually what I'm going to do now. That's 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 so true that that's just what I need to fucking do. Um, there we go. Let's see here. Let me go to edit stream, and we have Emo Whale Island. There we go. I, lo I love that the way that I remember to spell island is just is land. Like, what is an island? Well, it, it is land, okay? Just fucking use your brain, dumbass. <sighs> Silly Billy. Uh, 
Um, wait, are these frogs? Bro, this is not Gold Frog Island. This is Emo Whale Island. Okay? Now let me drink my milk and listen to MCR in peace. <laughs> hey, yo. What's up? Why I did not know I was speaking to a distinguished... Well, by my golden gizzard. Or sorry. <coughs> <coughs> well, indeed, by my golden gizzard. A slow toe child. Whatever brings you here, slow toe. You stand in the presence of golden chief si Silos. I'm so fantastic that I'm the only frog hereabouts who leaps by cyclone. Slick, eh? Slow toe, is that not the phantom hourglass that you carry? It certainly means, most certainly and undoubtedly, that you know old Oceus. We go way back, that old codger and me. That sounds like an insult, but I swear it's just a name. <laughs> It sounds pretty fucking horrible, actually. <laughs> he watched out for me until I found a safe harbor in this, in this secret spot. On Emo Whale Island. He's helping us look for the ghost ship. A girl named Tetra was taken away by it. She's Link's friend. Ghost ship, you say? I've heard of that dreary vessel from my guilt minions. Do you have any notions as to where the ghost ship might be? Not a clue yet. First, we need to save the spirits that are scattered on the seas. Ah, but the sea must seem very vast for beings such as yourselves. Vastly vast. More vast than a vast vase you'd ever seen. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. <laughs> Let me help you with a gift, Link. You got the Cyclone Slate. That is the Cyclone Slate. By drawing symbols on it, you can ride Cyclones too. Want to leap elsewhere with your ship? Then spring into action with the Slate. Could you tell us more about these symbols? My guilt minions are strewn over the seas. Six minions total, sparkling in the sun. Find them. Ask them. They each know one symbol. Then by drawing symbols on the Slate, your ship will fly to that spot in a flash. So all we need to do is meet the golden frogs and learn their symbols. But are you really sure that we can take something so wonderful with us? How can I just sit back and do nothing for you, friends of Oceus? The sea is vast, vastly vast, and that will help you bridge the distances. Our deepest thanks, your golden majesty. No, no. That's Golden Chief. That's what the lady frogs call me. I feel so uncomfortable. <laughs> that, that man is a fucking unit. Your fingers were unavailable. You were feasting on wings. Why does he look like he's... Oh my fucking god, chat. Holy shit. Why is there a pic of me in the upper left corner, though? <laughs> <laughs> hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me let me let me move out the way so you can see the full thing. And then I'll let you guys get it fully on screen. Okay, okay. There we go. I want you to know that this this is what we came here for. <laughs> oh my god. Um he looks like he's on the FBI watch list. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> okay. Beautiful. Honestly? Like, legitimately? This is... Okay, you know what? Hold up, I'm gonna take a picture of this, chat. I want you to know. I'm taking a picture of this and posting it. This is honestly perfect. 
there we go. That that's going to Instagram. And honestly, not as bad as drawing yourself as a Wojak, though. Six, this is Emo Whale Island. Um, there we go. Okay. Did you find the treasure? What, the Cyclone Slate? Sounds like that will make sailing a breeze. Let's keep an eye out for those gold-plated amphibians. I can't remember what voices I did for Lionbeck, so we're just going to get whatever. Snap, yep, this is going into my cringe collection. Dude, any point of my life ever can go into the cringe collection, okay? There is no, there is no, like, specific thing that would go in there. The entirety of my fucking life would go in there. What attractions can visitors visit on Emowell Island? Um, well, here, let me turn the game volume down, because the game do be kind of hella loud right now. Hold up, hold up. So at Emo Will Island here, we have great things. We have every, we have several concerts every day. We always have MCR. We always have Lincoln Park. We always have Get Scared, and we always have Three Days Grace. And if you come on the right, if you come on a, <laughs> I'm a high school girl with too many emotions week, then we have Sleeping with Sirens, and we have Pierce the Veil, and you know what? Oh my God, it'll be a good third one. Oh my god, hold up, hold up. What's a good third one? We need a third one. We need a third one. What's a good third one? What what, what other band would show up on Emotional High School Curl Week? <laughs> so I can tell you right now. Pierce the Veil and, uh... What is it? Pierce the Veil and fucking Sleeping with Sirens absolutely would be there. Oh god. But yeah, if you come on that week, we will for sure have those two. And if you want to, you can go by... You can go down the emo water slide. It has, it has the perp, has the um, what is it? The perfect amount of water to make your eyeliner look extra messy to show how truly sad you are. Not enough water to make your eyeliner come off, but enough eyeliner to mess it up to let everyone see the emotion that you feel on the inside. And at the gift shops, we have emo teddy bears. We have emo alligators, and we have emo whales. And if you come on spe special occasion occasions, it's uh, you buy one, and then you can get a special gift card to Hot Topic as well. Which we also have on the other side of the island. We always have a Hot Topic, both the old version and the new version. The scary one that makes, you think, makes people think you worship Satan, and the new one that makes you think you have an anime and hentai addiction. Both just as important, by the way. Both very, very important. Flyleaf? Yes! Yes! We have a hair salon on every street corner. They only know how to do emo cuts. They've never done a single... Um, they've never... They've never... <laughs> I'm sorry, between my phone and chat just now, I can't. They've never known how to do any haircut that isn't a... That isn't an emo haircut. They can, they, they can, they can do it all. They can, they can get the, uh, you know, the, the long, straight goth look if they need it. They can get the emo fringe, both long, short, and medium. They can give you the straight bangs to look like your Wednesday from the Adams Family. Whatever you need. And when you go to the salon, you also can go to the next door to the. <laughs> we also have the emo VR simulator. The makeup stores only sell black makeup. If you ask for a braid, you get banned off the island. <laughs> Want to customize your ship if you got the parts? I've got the time. Hold up. We need to customize it, and we got to make it look absolutely atrocious. Um, And then, on uh, Emo Island, we have the... um. Oh, my God. What type of amusement park would they have, I wonder? Ew, that cannon looks fucking nasty, bro. What the fuck is that? Bro, let's attach that shit. Fuck yeah. Hell yeah! Simple handrail? Fuck you, no. Know, wood handrail. There we go. Looking snazzy, bro. Let me let me customize my boat real quick, and then we'll check it out. Normal chimney? You're a normal chimney. Got him. Battle wheel? Oh, fuck yeah. There we go. 
We're looking like a unit, slowly but surely. Actually, wait. Do these things have stats? Hold up, before we continue talking about Emo Whale Island, do these fucking parts have stats? I think I was unaware. Looks like it would shatter after a single fire, but it's tough. I mean, it does honestly look like it would shatter after a single fire. A very basic handrail. Sometimes the basics are the best. I mean, that is true. There we go. Okay, I actually have to use the bathroom, so I might go to the bathroom shortly, and that'll give me more time to think about attractions to, e um, to Emo Whale Isle. Actually, yeah, that'll be a perfect thing. That'll let me use the bathroom, and that'll let you guys and me think of more attractions. What are, what are, okay, I will leave for the uh, two-minute um, ad break, and for anyone watching, what are some more attractions that would be on Emo Whale Island? I need to know. We still need an amusement park, and we still need some other attractions. And, you know, what kind of decorations we got out? I gots to know. But I'm going to think of some, too. I will be right back.
amusement, no amusement, nothing is amusing in this world of pain. <laughs> oh my fucking god, bro. That shit's fucking great. I come back and that's the first shit I see. That is amazing. That is fucking amazing. Um, even the dogs are emo. I don't know, definitely wouldn't have a Disneyland, though. Maybe Universal. Emo bitches love Marvel and Harry Potter. We even have an emo petting zoo. We we have emo goats, emo horses, even emo bears. Oh my god, you're right. They have panda bears. They have makeup on their eyes already. They're already emo. No fucking way. And even... <laughs> They also, at the petting zoo, brand new, we have emo emus, okay? My, they, they were, they were specially created by my sibling. They, they, they drew them and created them, okay? Emo emus have been brought into this world just for, uh, to be perfect, the perfect being. Um, <laughs> and our most popular attraction, emo video games, like, Emo Legend of Zelda, it's like normal Legend of Zelda, but Link dyes his hair black, or is only black and complains a lot. We also have Emo Halo, Emo Fire Emblem, and Emo Dark Souls. So much, and so much Emo more. Even the trees. The trees are, uh... The trees have a gray and black pattern all the way up the base of them. And then the leaves are all black with white at the frosted tips. And the frosted tips represent the little bit of hope they have left in their life. In the form of next week's concert, Screamers Week, we've got Get Scared, B Bring Me the Horizon, and Suicide Silence headlining with a special visit from Black Veil Brides. I know, I know. Feel free to come along and join and scream your heart out. Scream and say the things your your parents would never actually care to listen to. Because they just don't understand. I can't. The fucking tree thing. I don't know why. I went into the bathroom and I immediately thought of the fucking tree thing, dude. I don't know why. The frosted tip symbol. I, I love it. I fucking love it. And then the emo emu. That credit goes entirely to my sibling. They, uh... They drew an emo emu forever ago, and it was fantastic. If, is you, if you visit wearing anything but black or gray, you'll be kicked out. <laughs> and, um, I, uh, I can't, I can't fucking stop laughing at this shit. Onward, my friends. Okay, good, good. I'm making my way downtown. Fuck. Wait, hold up. I don't need to do this. I've got the special ability. Explosions! Um, what is the other thing? There was, um... I think I had a few other emo attractions in my mind, but I can't think of them at the moment. I don't know why. I just can't think of them. That's all right. I wanted to say the emo emo emus, and then I wanted to say the trees. Like those were by far the funniest fucking things I could think of. The grass is painted black with special nature safe emo paint, because we here at the at the emo whale island care about nature and its feelings, unlike your parents, when all they do is ask you to do the dishes for the thirteenth time. When you keep telling them, Mom, I can't do the dishes. I think my band broke up this week. You just wouldn't understand. <laughs> you can tell them it's not being lazy. You can tell them he, they just don't. <laughs> Fucking. <laughs> oh my god. I need to shut up. I'm laughing at this too much. I can't talk. I can't laugh at this while I'm fucking playing. You fucked. Shit. There we go. Got him. You 
no, I was kind of oh no 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 He ate my time. You dick. Oh fuck. Honestly, now now I feel like that has to become an actual thing. You know, they can't just they can't just not make Emo Island a thing. That has to be a real thing now. I just realized I went the long way around. My dumbass really did go the long way around. Ow, fuck. Hold up. Yeah, because my... Oh, yeah, that's right, because the Island of Gusts, the item I got was the bomb. And that's what lets me go through the temple faster. That's pretty much what you're supposed to do with this game. This game is very interesting in the form of you need to, like, basically use these items to get to this temple faster. Because you're on that time limit and that time crunch. Taking notes. Hey, yo. What the fuck? What is this shit? Why the fuck did I write this here? <laughs> Wait. Oh, my God. Hold up. Hold up. We also have the emo stream edgy gamer, the founder of Emo Well Island. Emo... Emo Island is surprisingly the only country on Earth that actually cares about the environment. Epic. <laughs> we have we have a we have a parents booth where you can leave your annoying non-emo parents while you explore the island. There's no gender on Emo Island because everyone dresses androgynously anyways. The parents booth has activities like boring TV, books, and whatever else parents like. We're putting too much work into this for them not to make it real. More sociological development than any modern government for real. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. This shit's golden. Make it real! Make it happen! Got your ass! Fuck! What is this? What do you have for me? Oh shit. Force gem. Good? Um. Look. Okay. I'm trying to be stealthy. I'm not gonna lie. These guys are kind of scaring me. Are there any enemies in video games that you guys find like particularly terrifying? Cause I'm not gonna lie. The enemies inside of uh, what was it? Inside of um. Skyward Sword are pretty terrifying to me. The one, the uh, the Guardians or whatever, the ones that are in like the special realm. If anyone knows what I'm talking about, that is. I feel like someone probably understands what I'm talking about. Because th those fucking guys are terrifying. There we go. Bombs away! Ka chow Oh. That's it? Okay. Bitch. You bitch. <gasps> ah, fuck. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. I need, I need HP. Give me HP before I die. All right, here we go. Sorry if I'm not looking at the camera much this stream. It's honestly with this game, it is genuinely impossible to really look up and play. <clears throat> at least while I'm, uh, you know, if I'm doing something other than like moving, and even then, moving is usually rather difficult with this. Like, opening this treasure chest is so difficult. Like, it kind of, it kind of is possible, but it's like the most form of, po it's the most difficult form of possible, imaginable. Fuck. Yeah, hold up. I'm gonna throw that down. And we're gonna go around. We're just gonna go around and hope they don't notice. Hold up, they don't notice, they don't notice. They still don't notice, get jabated. Edgy Gamer's better. He's just like Homelander. He is better. Hold up, hold up. There we go. Actually, I think it would be really fun to have an Edgy Gamer Minecraft server where we all live on Emo Island. Half-Life 2, 2 is too scary for me to play. We are getting a new special attraction next week. Emo Barney the Dinosaur? Bro, what? <laughs> Bro, emo Barney the dinosaur hits different. You just wouldn't, you wouldn't understand just like my parents. <laughs> Fuck. 
Oh god. I hate you, you hate me, we're all we're all going to scream. <laughs> what? Fantastic. Grab your emo bats and beat up emo Barney for VIP tickets to emo band of your choice. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, bro. This shit's great. I fucking love it. Like, I, I keep, like, trying to focus on the game, and I look over, and they're like, Emo Island! Like, I... <laughs> you know, what type of other animals are kind of like emo? Like, emus work because of emo emu. It, like, just rolls off the tongue well. You know? But, like, what is another animal that I think would work really well? Oh, leave this to me! This is the door of wisdom. I will use my powers to open it. Are you ready? Then tap the door. Tap. What's another, like, emo-looking animal? Like, even without me, like, doing anything to it, what other animal already looks kind of emo? Like, an emu works just because of the name, but what? what is another animal? I don't know. What... What what type of animal makes chat think of e emo the most? I gotta ask. Are raccoons emo? Because I have to... No, they're like little bandits, though. They're more bandits than emo. We all haven't mentioned cats yet. Maybe that's too obvious. Probably. Cats, cats are pretty obvious. Cats are implied. <laughs> when you go to Emo Island, you're given one free cat. What the fuck is that? Ew! Or sorry, ew! Eyeball monsters? Allow me to explain. Those are phantom eyes. They act as extra eyes for the phantoms. If one sees you, yeah. What happens if one sees you? If you'd shut the fuck up, I'd probably finish. Okay. The phantoms will find you, and then it only gets worse. So be cautious. However, unlike the phantoms, these creatures can be defeated. Find them on the map. Make sure to defeat them before they see you. I get it, so you have to find a way to hit them before they see you? Come on, let's get going to a safe zone if they see you, Link. Alright, I mean, I guess. I don't really know what these eyeballs do, so I'm just gonna kinda go with it. Yeah, I don't think this gust is going anywhere anytime soon. The gust seems to be permanent. Oh, hold up, hold up. Gaming? Fuck! Oh no! Shit! 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 I think I died. Black goldfish are pretty metal. Um, see, goldfish are adorable until their eyes pop out of their sockets. That then it's just kind of sad, you know. There we go. Absolutely fucking played. I got 30 seconds back, chat. That's 30 seconds that my parents would have never spent with me. <sighs> this bit is not going to be old to me. I'm sorry. I'm going to make this fucking joke all the way until like in the future on way later streams. And I'm still going to find the shit funny. Oh, dude, did I actually outplay him just now? That's actually pretty epic. Uh, can we can we get some hype in chat for the outplay? The genuine outplay of the century? Uh, do you mind, random guy? Okay, stay in your zone. Stay in your zone. This is not your zone. This is my zone. Um, I have no fucking idea where I'm going. Um, what the hell does it want me to do? This isn't bombable, is it? Like, I don't think so. Is it? No. No, there's no way these are bombable. I wouldn't think they're bombable. There wouldn't really any be, be any logic behind them being bombable. Hold up. Oh, I see what I need to do. Hold up, shovel time. Shovel night time. I'm just, this is just me fighting my alarm at fucking 11 a.m. Because I don't want to go to work. So what the hell was that supposed to be? 
What the fuck did that switch even do? Is my question. No, not the. Let me get. Let me get my battle shovel ready. I've played enough shovel knight to know where this goes. Has anyone in chat actually played Shovel Knight? I heard it's extremely good, like an objectively fantastic game. Oh, all right. Well, I guess we're going over there then. Oh, fuck. Hold up. And there's a wall here. Perfect. We're just figuring out all the secrets. We're figuring out all the secrets all at one time. I never would have thought to kill the surveying enemies. That seems like a little weird. Gra um, hold up. And next month, we're getting emo penguins and emo all nations. Emo penguins sounds fantastic, because penguins are already fucked up individuals anyways. Make them emo and oh god. <laughs> like, penguins literally... <clears throat> penguins will legit fucking uh, pay rocks to get with women. It's fucked up. Look it up. Look it up. It is it is unreal what penguins what penguins do. It's like dolphins, dude. It's fucked. Um what why would why would their eyes do that? Can you throw your boomerang through those holes? I don't think so. And in February 2023, we're getting our greatest attraction ever, the your parents actually love you VR experience. <laughs> dude, that shit's not real. No one's parents actually love their children, bro. That shit's fake. Get out of here. But that's why we have the VR experience. Because even though it may never happen IRL, we can make it happen in virtual reality. Just for you. Um, I can't remember why their eyes do that. It's something about, like... It's something about their eyes that make them very easy to pop out. Like, I don't really know. Gold, Goldfish can get really sickly really easily. From, like, a bunch of different things. So I can't particularly remember what does it, because I've seen it before. Like, I think I'm, like, my parents had a goldfish at their house, and I believe its eyes literally popped out a socket. You can come through here again, talk to me. I'll teach you something valuable for stopping by. Okay. If I come through again, why the fuck would I come through again? Use your items valuably. What the fuck did, why didn't you give me a key? I need a key, motherfucker, and you didn't give me one. Actually, wait, didn't I get a key? Never mind, I did get a key. I, I was wrong. I was wrong. I lied. I lied to you all. Um, I also give rocks to women to get them to sleep with me. It really works. <laughs> Lol. Damn, that's horrifying. Igor is the scariest kind to me. Yeah, it's... I believe, um, it's... It might be something about the way their, like, bodies hold up or whatever, but their their eyes are very easy to just pop out. Bro, look at that skill! Just draw a bunch of scribbles until the enemies die. If you scribble your way to victory, no one can possibly beat you, okay? It's a guaranteed win. That 15 seconds? Nice. 15 more seconds for me to think about how much my parents don't love me. Got you. I got you. Got you. And then we... <laughs> and then we have the emo battle royale, where you can fight to the death with a bunch of other emos for one free band t-shirt. Which will save you approximately seventy dollars. <laughs> Cause them bitches be expensive. I mean, I'll be honest, they do be expensive though. Like hella expensive. Like um, has anyone in chat recently bought any band merch at all? Or is that just like, uh, am I the only one who's recently done that? I won't lie. It, it is incredibly pricey. God damn it. Because I'll be honest with you guys. Like, buying band merch. Like, there's honestly quite a quite a few cool band merchandise out there. But there's also, like, there's so much of it. Like, it's just, 
it's not always worth your time just because of how pricey it gets. Like, it gets so pricey all the time that, like, I don't see how anybody can afford any of it. Like, I look at it like a Black Belt Bride shirt, right? And, like, even the cheapest ones are usually $20 for a t-shirt. But to be fair, that's that was, like, I don't know about, like, now. Like, now it might actually be even more expensive because I've not bought one in a while. Um, don't look up... <laughs> and not the official source. And not from official sources. Um, let's see here. Just a little further, the clue to the ghost ship should be up ahead. How long have I been streaming this game? An hour and a half, damn. Time flies by. That's how you know you've been having a good time. Bro, what the fuck? Bro, what the fuck? Get the fuck off of me. Okay, what is this? Before you lies the second tablet governing the crest. All right, um... Hold up, how long has it been since I've done Japanese? If I can, I would like to do uh, Jap... Let me see if I can write these in, in uh, Hidagana. So I know for numbers, it's just like two like that. I might have to look up some of them though. I remember one, two, three, because they're super easy. Um, I kind of remember four, and I don't really remember five. Like, I remember how to say five, but I don't remember five, you know? Like, I feel like that's genuinely kind of difficult to remember. Like, the actual symbols they use. Are you fucking kidding me? Fuck, 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 fuck. Damn it. Damn it. There you go. I'm safe. For now. Before you lies the cursed tablet, it, it brings ruin upon all who gaze upon it. Um. Okay, so we don't have two, we have ruin. Um, what would be a great symbol of ruin? I don't know. What, what the fuck would symbolize a ruin? Um. I don't know. Let me just do like a There we go. We'll just do a sad face. Damn it. Damn it. Yeah, we'll definitely do sad face. Holy fuck. There's so many. Why are there so many? Yeah, I might have to switch games, though, about like, the hour and 40 min uh, mark, because, dude, my arm's getting tired holding up this fucking Wii U gamepad. This Wii U gamepad gets hella heavy over time. Like, you wouldn't think it would be that heavy, but it just gets that heavy. There we go. Okay, get this out. Got him! Ugh, and I honestly don't think I can play this game left-handed, to be honest with you. Like, I am probably way too right-handed to be trying to play this shit left-handed. Like, I could attempt, but I don't think it would go well. Here, let me try. I, I need I need to do something. My left hand, my left arm is killing me. <clears throat> Devin brings ruin. They're adding Rise to Game Pass next month. Rise? What do you mean, Rise? I don't, I don't think I know what you mean. What, what do you mean? Uh, I actually don't know the game Rise. What is that about? An eye, of ma an eye with mascara running down it? Yes. Yes. Absolutely. What the fuck did that say? The Sacred Crest both begins and ends with me. Discover the crest and the way through the door shall be revealed. Okay, so we got one. And hold up, hold up. There we go. He's got mascara running down his eyes because he's sad. He's depressed, damn it. Is he depressed? Sir, is he depressed? No, he's just listening to too much MCR. I should have known. Before you lies the third tablet governing the crest. All right. So let's see if I can do this left-handed. I probably can't. Hold up. One. Two. Three. 
fuck, this feels wrong. Oh god. Okay, I'll just get in get in the corner. Get in the corner! Get the fuck away! Please. I have three minutes to do this shit. Before it is a game over. Before my soul gets sucked out my face in the most unattractive way possible. Uh Oh god. Oh god. How do you roll? Rub it away! Oh, the jukes! Legendary! Fucking legendary! Yes! Um. Monster Hunter Rise. Now a game called Rise. Oh, you shouldn't stall and play Skywalker Saga. Solo or co-op doesn't matter. Game Pass actually got a good game for once. Well, I know Game Pass does have, uh... I know for a while there, Game Pass, uh... Like, Mortal Shell was on Game Pass. And I believe, like, Final Fan There was quite a few Final Fantasy games on Game Pass as well. Like, every now and then, Game Pass gets some pretty good games. Like, some pretty amazing games. But it... It is like every... It, it's... I don't think all of them are that fantastic at the moment. I think they have to, like, buy rights for it. And, like, depending on what month you get it, it can be really, really worthwhile. Yeah. I'm honestly, I'll be honest with you, my left arm is killing me. Before you lies the fourth tablet governing the crest. Four? Um, I don't remember how to draw four. So we're gonna, we're gonna consult my phone. <laughs> um, let's see here. Let me turn my phone down. I'm just gonna look it up. Honestly, I've not done my Japanese lessons in a while, so G I have absolutely no fucking clue how. Let's see here, because I remember. Actually, wait. This 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 thing on my phone is not going to show me how to do four. Damn it! That's all right. That's okay. I'm gonna do my best attempt, and you guys can tell me if I'm wrong. <laughs> More people need to play it. Oh, absolutely. I'd say Skywalker Saga. is definitely one of the better ones, for sure. Like, that is, like, objectively a fantastic game. There are four stone tablets that govern the crest. Hmm, I wonder what shape the sacred crest, crest is. Are you taking notes? There are four tablets, so... Um... I was about to say, can I walk up and do this? It was an hourglass all along! No, just like Phantom Hourglass! That's so hashtag deep! Oh my god, that's deeper than the last B BMTH album! That's as deep as the Suicide Silence song I heard the other day! Even Motionless and White, White didn't get that deep. It's next level, man. It's next level. Press the Sacred Crest against the sea chart to transfer it. The Temple of Courage will open to the holder of the Sun Key. Uh... The fuck? Is it this one? Is it not this one? Oh no, it's backwards. Hold up. Is it here? No, I actually don't know where it is. Uh... Ah, huh. yeah, I actually don't really know where that is. I think that's on part of the map I've never seen before. Yeah, I've literally never seen it. Are you telling me? Are you fucking telling me? I need to get my absolute fucking dumb ass out into the ocean. To look at this map. To go see this shit. Is that what you're telling me? Because if so, I'm kind of pissed. wonder what it means by pressing the C chart to the crest. Feels like I've seen the chart on that tab before, but it's a little different. Maybe it's upside down. Let's take another look. 
Oh! Wait a second. It is upside down! Is it not... Is it not right? So this is down here. Huh. I don't really know what it means. But... What the fuck? What kind of puzzle is this? Okay, I don't understand it's upside down. Can I flip it around? Can I, like... Can it tell when I have it upside down? I'm so lost, bro. Um, High on Life is coming soon, and I can't wait for it. I'm glad Skywalker sa Saga. Wait, have you played it, or just going off what others said? Um, I'm just going off what other people have what are other people have said. Um, Big Brain, it was that one, but it's upside down. It's upside down. Lol, XD, it would be the upper right of those three little dot islands by the rock border. On DS, you're meant to close the DS. How the fuck do I do that with this? Wait a second. Wait a second. What the fuck do I like? What symbolizes closing the DS? How the fuck? How in the absolute fuck do I do that shit? Uh, bro, hey, I don't know. <laughs> what the fuck? Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get up and try a few things. Give me a second. I don't. Uh. Link, you. Wow, Link, you figured out what it meant by pressing them together. The crested. I did it. I don't got a fucking clue how I did it, but we did it. I, I guess I did it. Best gamer. <laughs> Best gamer ever. Doesn't know how to do it. Did it anyways. I know. I know. Hold your applause. Hold your applause. Hold your applause. I know. I'm amazing. I get it. Save your autographs on Emo Island for the next time you visit there. I'll be there. I'll be on Emo Well Island. I promise. I'm always there. I never leave. That's where the streams are done. And there's a stream every day. You know for a fact I gotta be there. Okay? Okay. What the fuck did I do? What the fuck did I do? I don't understand what the fuck I did. I'm distraught. This game gives me emotional damage. <laughs> this game gives me more emotional damage than my parents, bro. Shit's wild. Shit don't make no sense. No sense at all. Well, um, I don't fucking know, bro. Let's go to the store. What does the store have? The fairy was tired of you taking so long, so she just did it for me? I That is believable. I could believe that. Welcome, shopper. How can I help you? Tap the screen. There's a Zora skill. Um, yeah, 200 rupees. Why not? This rare skill was dropped by a Zora. I feel like that'll become important eventually. We're going to play left-handed for a minute. Because I don't want to get off just yet. Um, Because I didn't realize that this game would fucking tire out my left hand so bad. Um, Honestly, I don't really know what other game I'd want to play after this, though. Because like, I'm having a lot of fun with this game right now. Like, I don't know. I just haven't played the game for a minute. And I just, I just came back to playing it, and I'm having a good time. Having a really good time. I'm having a, gr a grand old time. Excellent, Link. You have rescued the Spirit of Wisdom. You must locate one more finder and then the ghost ship. You should have... Wait, what? Oh, Power Gym. Nice! Bring out the full power of spirits. There are 20 Spirit Gems for each of the spirits scattered far and wide. Find as many as you can. That will make you strong. Will it, though? Will it, though? Um, I have played Ocarina of Time, Six Foot Slug. I believe it is a fantastic Zelda game. And I actually have it on my... I've played it 
I've played it on the collector's edition on GameCube. And I've played it on the, um... Yeah, I've played it on the collector's edition on GameCube. And I've played it on the, um, 3DS. And I've played it... And I have it on my Wii U. I actually have quite a few Zelda games on my Wii U. Um... When I probably end the stream for this game, which like I said will probably be shortly just because my hand's that tired. I'll show you guys what Zelda games I have on here. Yeah, because I'm not going to lie, holding this bitch up and trying to use it is killing me. Right now I'm trying to play without holding it and playing right-handed. And I, it's it's messing me up bad. Bubba bad You have the original Nintendo 64 cartridge. Shut up, that's actually crazy. I've, uh, I've never played it on the... Actually, I think I've played it on the 64 maybe once. Like, one time. So that's actually kind of insane that you've played it on the 64. I think I have may have played it on the 64 possibly one time, but I don't actually know. If I have or not. So that's a, that's a big I don't know, fam. Okay, so I can't go up there. And then I can't go over there. Can I? Yeah, no, I can't go over there. The main Zelda game that I played a lot of, though, was uh, definitely Twilight Princess. Twilight Princess is probably the Zelda game that I played the most. It's, I like, I don't really, I mean, yeah, it's kind of funny that the edgy Zelda game is what the edgy gamer played the most. But, like, in all honesty, yeah, that's just the one that I did play by far the most. I don't really know why. It just, it just stuck with me, you know? Um, actually, wait, can I take the chicken up top? Hold up, can I take him up here? Nope. If I could have, then I would have totally found something. Um, I believe the- oh, I have mail! A special delivery! This is a letter from Edo of Cannon Island. Ahem, ready for this? I'm not. Hey, you Link, I've got some very big news! Big, big news. See, I've been working on a salvage arm for a long time, but now it's ready. This gorgeous piece of machinery lets ships pull up treasure from the sea floor. I'm going to sell this thing to the first one who gets here. Ready, set, sail. Who's going to be the lucky customer to claim it? Edo. And that's the end of it. Got all that, sir? Then I'm out of here. Um... I still want you to play Skywalker Saga, but I don't want to bug you on it too much. Um, I do want to play Skywalker Saga, but I feel like I should play it probably with somebody. Because I feel like Lego games are 100% like a couch co-op game. And I feel like that would probably work the like as a really good experience with couch co-op. Um... Have you ever, uh, do you prefer Ocarina of Time or Majora's Mask? Probably Majora's Mask. Um, I like Ocarina of Time, but I was always more of a, uh, Twilight Princess person over Ocarina of Time. Um, just because that was the one that I played more. And I just see, because, like, the, Zel the the order I played Zelda games was, like, Wind Waker, Ocarina of Time, um, hold up, hold up. Got him! Got his ass! But yeah, I played Wind Waker, then I played Ocarina of Time, then I played, like, Majora's Mask, I believe. Um, I didn't beat it, by the way. These are just the times that I played it. And then I remember playing, Fant um, like, a little bit of Link to the Past, maybe. And, um, a little bit of Link's Awakening. N not much, though. And then I played a shit ton of Twilight Princess. And eventually I got Skyward Sword. And, um, that's pretty much how I played, like, a lot of them. That's, for the most part, how I played most of them in order. I eventually got Spirit Tracks and Phantom Hourglass and a few other games. But the one that I played probably the most, like, the most, was Twilight Princess and Wind Waker. And I don't know why, but I just had such a fun time with both of them. And I always looked forward, like, starry-eyed to play it every single time I got to. Um, quick question. Do you have a Discord? Because I uh, want to show you some modded Borderlands items I found 
on your Krieg lol. Oh, absolutely, man. Feel free. It does want me to share the Discord link, Edgy? Absolutely. Go ahead. Um, there you go. Just You just posted cringe there? Oh, God. Let's see. What cringe am I about to see? I need I need to see it. I need to see what cringe is waiting on me. Edgy Gamer actually checking his Discord. No way. Well, the Green Ranger looks pretty cool. A modded weapon? What does it do? Dear God, float like a butterfly. The bee. Recharge delay, 0.99 seconds. Absorb chance, 127% chance. And then like a billion capacity. Holy fuck. And the max health increase on that one? Block. It takes more than that to kill a bull moose. Bruh. Shit's wild. And then the other one, block, it just increases your max health by like too much. Plus 22 and plus 13. Jeez, bro. The amp damage, 1 billion fucking extra damage. Yeah, see, that's that's some wild-ass numbers there, to be honest with you. The art channel. Ooh, some good art. Where did we post the cringe at? Was it in the memes? Oh, God. I wasn't lying when I said I drew myself on. <laughs> no, you can't be God and be inspired by other media. You need to be a part of my music fandom or else you're a poser. No stop. Hee hee, big boot, go stop, stop. <laughs> the platform boobs be, boots be, the platform boobs, the platform boots be hitting different. Oof, nice shot, buddy. The big frog spread the word about you. Did he? So want to know about the draw on the cyclone slate to fly right here? Here it goes, pay attention. Okay, here's the mark. Draw this to return here. Um, we're gonna... There we go. Did you get that, buddy? Yes, I did. Onward! In memes, Edgy missed final announcement for Emo Whale Island. Um, what's the final announcement for Emo Whale Island? What is it? I need to see. I need to see. Is that the Grim Reaper? He, yes, it is. He's here to take my soul. Oh my god. We have one final mega emo announcement for Emo Island September 24th, 2023. We are getting emo unicorns. Yes! Absolutely. I would love that. Um, I apologize. No, I don't. I'll put two videos of your um, 25 game ad. Fuck you. Yeah, I don't know why ads randomly fucking come up in my gameplay. They just like to. I'll probably watch the videos uh, after stream, but I imagine if they're using any of the weapons you have or any of the equipment you've shown on there, that shit's going to insta-kill anything. Literally anything. It doesn't matter what the fuck it is. Doing like 1 billion damage per hit. Like, that's just unreal, bro. What's my man's got? Yes, yes, it's finally complete. The salvage arm will let you reach to the bottom of the sea to sunken treasure. What, aren't you the shrimplet? And now you want the salvage arm? Did you come racing over here after getting one of my letters? <laughs> you dropped everything to rush here for my mention. You're a real fan of my work, aren't you? Yes. <laughs> Butter me up all you want, but it's gonna cost you big time. So show me how much you want the salvage arm. Shout with some gusto! Want the salvage arm? Then make your voice ring out loud and clear. We want the salvage arm! We want the salvage arm! I will decide your price based on that. Okay, go. I want the salvage arm, please! I need it! That's gusto for... <laughs> <laughs> That's gusto. For that scream, well... I'll sell the salvage arm that... Oh, God, no. <laughs> I thought so. The price is a little... Oh, hold up. A little, little too steep even for someone like you. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Decide your Okay. Ah! Now those are some pipes! No complaints here! Well, I'll sell you the salvage arm for 200 rupees! <laughs> Still walking around with a bunch of rupees, eh? Yes. Doesn't surprise me. One bit. Okay, take it then. The salvage arm is yours. 
<laughs> because Jeff Bezos is em emophobic. He's trying to censor you with ads. Oh no, I'm not lol. I was too low of a level for that. He said your screamo skills are weak. I am not going to do actual screamo. No, I am too anxious to do that on sc stream, okay? I'll scream, like actual scream, yes. But screamo, no. I've not done that in ye I've not done that consistently since probably 2020. 2020 was the last year that I consistently did screamo and could actually do it to a f decent effect. <laughs> and even if I had done it recently, I don't think I could do it. I'd be too anxious. I cannot believe this game based my price off of screaming. Well, I apologize. Uh, hopefully my scream didn't hurt anyone's ears, because I literally screamed. Then get on board! Now I need to hear that. Okay. Onward to new seas! Aw, oh, damn, it didn't play, but I saw it in chat. Hold up, I'll play it for you. I got you, fam, I got you. Oh, shit, what is... Ah, fuck! Okay. Okay, that's okay. Let me, let me look. Where's that? Where's that? I know it's here. Where the fuck is it? I know it's here. Here it is. The island is Dio, and I am Jotaro. The island looks up at my boat. Oh, you are approaching me. Dio. Yada yada does it. Nothing that looks like the crest, anyway. Just a bunch of sea. Well, maybe there's something here, but below at the bottom of the sea. Don't look at me like I'm crazy. Maybe it's down under the sea. Under the sea. But I'm not getting wet, kid. I uh, can't even swim. I was about to say, how do I activate the, uh... Salvage! Alright, kid, I'll tell you all about how to use the salvage arm. Uh, okay. All kinds of treasure rest at the bottom of the sea. Use the salvage arm to pull that treasure up. See the bar controlling the arm at the bottom of the screen? Tap and drag the right, right to left to move the arm under the water. Move it up, up or down to adjust how fast the arm moves. But there are... Octo mines down there that will explode if you touch them. It takes a steady hand to move the arm carefully and steer clear of them. Oh, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up. This is a weird mini game, I'll be honest with you. Aw, oh, damn it. Okay, I see. I see the issue now. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Bro, gaming! Real gamer hours? No way! No way! No fucking way! Absolutely no cap. There's no way. Okay. Wait, bring her up! Bitch, what? No. 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 What? No. 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 What are you doing, kid? I'm sorry. Reeling the bitch back in is the hard part. She's fighting me. She's fighting me like the open sea. She... She's fighting me like my ex-wife for the child support. She took the kids and my money and my dreams. You got the sun key. This key is the same shape as a crest that you saw. Heh. <laughs> Strange looking key you got there. It's shaped like the sun, but what's that supposed to mean, kid? So it says it only opens up to the sun key. But I really don't know where to go after that. My only problem.
Um, fuck you. Edgy, even a deaf person could tell how weak your scream was. Bro, I literally pulled the mic away so you guys wouldn't hear me full-on scream. I need the Jot Jotaro the world. Oh, you need Jotaro the world? Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh, wait, a Jotaro the world. Um, I, I don't have that. I can give you a Dio. <laughs> I can give you a Dio the world, though. Will you serenade me, to, serenade me to sleep with the gentle sounds of abandon all ships? Bruh. Edgy, if you get mail, you should draw a dick on it. My ex-wife took my dad as well. Bro, what? Alright, then. <laughs> the world. Um, I don't know where I'm going. Um, menu, C chart. So it said I need to go to a place with the sun. But I don't know of a place with the sun chart on it. So, like, I don't really know. Like, it's not, it's not that map, right? It's not, wait a second, is that a sun? Do I need to go there? No, I don't think so. I don't think so. Yo, mama! I love how this randomly pops up. Emo Whale Island! Okay, not there. Oh, f old fuck lives there? Alright. And that's the guy with the fucking wants to bang a mermaid. Edgy screams like that. I mean, I kinda did, I won't lie. I did absolutely scream like Finn from fucking Adventure Time. Hmm. Menu. Uh. Collection. Sun key. Well, that doesn't help me at all. Rudo crown. All right. Um, let me get to land real quick, and then maybe. Yeah, go to the northern sea. Maybe there's the only place I think we've not really been would be the Northern Sea. Actually, wait, what's the red X over here? I actually don't really know what the fuck is over there, so let's just go over there. Oh, that's where treasure is! Well, you know what? I don't know what to do, so we're gonna go find treasure! I have 7.7 thousand channel points here. I need to start using them more. <laughs> well, I always try to make the ch uh, the um, the the um, redemptions really cheap so the people like who don't watch me a lot could still like participate. But if you guys want to, I can try to look up some more uh, channel redemptions tonight if you'd like. Also, I gotta ask because um, I'll probably be streaming something else probably after this and soon because my hand is still fucking killing me. Um, what game is everyone, like, feeling like watching tonight after Zelda? Because I still have Monster Hunter World, which I was trying to explore some of the end game of that. Um, I have Fi uh, Fire Emblem Three Hopes. I have, uh, Demon's Souls. And... Mm, trying to think. Those are the main games I haven't... Those are the main games I, I think I'm playing right now. Um, I would do, like, a different game, but I don't really have any other game that I'm playing at the moment. You could try the new Elden Ring PvP update. You should get a G-Note sound. Bruh. <laughs> um, yeah, I could probably try the, uh, the new Elden Ring PvP update. Um, uh, what exactly did they add in the new PvP Elden Ring update? We're going down under, folks! Yarg! There be treasure in them, thar seas! The hardest part about this is I'm not actually looking at the bottom screen. I'm looking at the TV, and it makes it incredibly difficult. 
So I can't actually see where my hand is. I can see, I can kind of see where it is, but I can't like actually see where it is, you know? Was that a hundred rupees? Holy fuck it was. God damn. Why is this one so much easier, bro? Okay, okay. Oh, damn. Ah! Ah! It hurts! It stings like the sun! It stings like the scurvy! Okay, hold up. We need to go back up. I need to go into focus mode. Edgy Gamer is now becoming Tryhard Gamer. He's becoming God Gamer. Hold up, hold up. Hold up. I'm getting there. I'm going places. Betrayal. Betrayal? Damn. Bro, I'm getting it. Oh, oh, fuck, 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 fuck. No. No, don't you fucking do it. Um, you know those arena areas in Dark Souls 3? Basically that. Go into any of those coliseums that you couldn't enter before, and you can do 1v1s group battles, and you can even able to use your summons. Oh, that sounds amazing. Then yeah, I'll probably try that out. You got some sand of hours. One minute is added to the Phantom Hourglass. Oh, okay. That's nice, I guess. Um... Let's go up here. I'm gonna go land on an island. Actually, wait, hold up. Can I just, can I just, yeah, I can just go right here. Good. Um, easy, it was easy. What I'll probably do is I'll probably go land on an island and then we'll probably try some uh, Elden Ring PVP. I think that'd be fine. I've not played Elden Ring in a minute and I think it'd be a fun thing. It'd be a, it'd be a stream that I don't have to save and I don't, I think that'd be pretty fun. Isle of Gust. Okay, see, I've already been there. I've already been there. That's Zaz's island. So what the what the fuck would it be? It's got to be down in the south, right? Like it has to be down south. <clears throat> There's no other place for it to be. Well, hold up. Let me try the traveler ship. Maybe the traveler ship has something for me. And if not, then we'll just start at the traveler ship. I don't think there's anything wrong with starting the traveler ship. Um, I wanna, but I do wanna land on an island first. Oh god, fuck out of here. Want to board the ship? Absolutely. Why, hello. Oh, it's you. And how are you? Want want me to train you in the art of swordsmanship? No thanks. What? What? Okay, my man's was absolutely in shock. Um, let's see what the slate looks like. How the fuck? So what does it look like? I just get eaten alive by a frog tornado. All right. Um. Hopefully, Elden Ring reinstalls by then, so I can so you can join me. I think that'd be a fun time. Um, here. What? How long have I been streaming this game? I've been streaming this game for two hours. We did one hour of Bloodborne, and we did two hours of this game, so that's three hours. I'll probably do, um... Uh... God, my hand is killing me, bro. Oh, look at... Woohoo! It's me, Mario. <laughs> that's not the voice. That's the voice. Honestly, okay, is chat excited for the Mario movie? I gotta ask. I'm honestly so excited for the Mario movie. That is probably, like, you guys are gonna get, you're gonna... <laughs> I know, like, Moist Critical usually reviews movies and everything. Edgy Gamer is gonna be getting on stream and talking about the Mario movie. I am very excited to see the Mario movie. Very excited. Uh, like, even, like, I know a lot of people are kind of disappointed by Chris Pratt's voice and everything, but dude, the animation looks so good and so clean that I just, I just want to fucking see it, bro. 
I just want to see that shit for real. Um, that is the voice now that Chris Pratt voices him. It is. It literally is the Chris Pratt going the, it's a me, Mario. <laughs> it's, and then he immediately goes, that's not the voice. And then the fucking trailer plays. And that's literally the voice he's doing. <laughs> My man goes like, wahoo. <laughs> Dude, and yes, Peach is super cute. They designed Peach in such a cute way. But she's also like super strong looking as well. I love it. Um, I am. It looks like a fun little romp. Oh. What the fuck? What? What is that? What? Yeah, what is correct? Nani? Or sorry. Nani? That nasty thing is between us and the island, kid. Now, its weak spot is? Well, I guess if I knew, we wouldn't be in this stew. The weak spot's gotta be on its body somewhere. One thing I do know, chart a new course so we stay on the move around it. Don't be a bobbing log. Evade attacks while you watch for its weak spot. And if that thing gets close with any attacks, blast away with the cannon. Got your ass. This is so weird. Honestly, not a bad idea for a boss fight. Seems pretty dope so far. I mean, it's a little silly, but that's okay. Got you. Got you. Got you. I'm going in. I'm going to go back out. Turn back around. And then come in again. Back up. Go back. Loop around for the finishing kill right there. And we're off! Okay, we're going in for the kill right here. They're coming up. They're not ready for the bob and weave. The bob and weeb? The bob and weeb. The bob and weeb, yep. We have bob and then we have a weeb. This is weirdly enough working extremely well. It's kind of stupid how well this is working. Got your ass. That's right. That's fucking right. You better back the fuck up. Hard turn to port. Got him. Finishing blow. We took out the sea beast. We are conquerors of the sea. Yarg, mateys. What the fuck was that? Good work. We did it. And I made it. You and I made a good team, kid. Now I can dock safely. Let's cruise over there, Navigator. Is this the place I was supposed to go? If so, that's actually convenient as hell. Um, I am, but I hope Chris Pratt actually does a good job. If I'm, if not, I'm eating the heart of his first. <laughs> Feed me Seymour like an ass. <laughs> Rule 34 already ruined the new Peach, no doubt. Oh, dude. Bro, before she was even created... They made a new Mario movie, and they they ruined the Peach, I assure you. It probably took all of literally negative time for them to ruin Peach. Like, can Peach just be adorable, or like, you know, strong, or like, cool? She doesn't have to be naked all the time, guys. God damn. God damn. Um... I remember correctly, isn't that like the hole, like, right here? Yeah, dude, no fucking way. Absolute cap, your boy memorized that shit. Actually, yeah, let me... Let me I, I see where I symbolized it on the side now. I have the hole right in front of the tree. On the side of the map over there, if you guys see it. Here's the sun key! Okay, so I was going to the right island. Huh. Perfect. Okay, well here, we'll get out of the cave and then we'll call it good for the stream. This is a nice little adventure, I think. Menu. Save. Yes. Here we go. Okay, well here, I'll actually go back to the uh, home screen so you guys can see all the different uh, Zelda games I have.
Well, hold up. Resume. We're gonna we're gonna get a save point first. Create restore point. Yes. There we go. Thank you. And back, and then home. And here, I'll go ahead and show you guys, and then I'll do the outro for the stream. And, um, yeah, I think it'd be fine to go back and play Elden Ring. I've not played Elden Ring in a while. <laughs> I think it'd be pretty cool to play. <sighs> I'll probably play that and then play something else later. I'm not sure yet. Um, okay, so, if you look right here, um, oh, god damn it, that highlights it. Here we go. Fuck. Uh... Can I highlight something without blocking anything? Fucker. Fucker. There we go. Damn it. Um, anyways. Here, actually, wait, 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 wait. I'll do that one, because that'll block it, because I know what those are. So, the Zelda games I have on my system is I have the original Zelda game, which you guys see me do a playthrough of. And I have The Adventure of Link, and I have A Link to the Past, and I have Ocarina of Time, and I have Majora's Mask. I also have Wind Waker HD, The Minish Cap, Spirit Tracks, and Phantom Hourglass. Those are, uh... Edgy, your notes are horrible. Damn. Lol. Um, here we go. I also ended up downloading the, uh, Fire... Fi uh, the first Fire Emblem, Fire Emblem the Sacred Stones, Fire Emblem Shadow Dragon, and, um, you guys saw me play the Metroid Prime Trilogy a while ago. And as far as Disc Zeldas, I have the, uh, Scoured Sword for Wii, and I also... Daddy, no! Daddy! Yes! Oh. Alright. <laughs> um, we also have uh, Twilight Princess and uh, Scoured Sword on the uh, Wii as well. I understand why this is so expensive. <laughs> I want to see Minish Cap for Spirit Tracks next. Um, yeah, that's not like a bad idea. But for now, we'll be heading over to Elden Ring. Um, now that we got to hear Plankton say Daddy, which is what we're all looking forward to all the time. Um... Anyways, uh, I thank you all, and I'm looking forward to seeing all of you later on my uh, Elden Ring, if you guys want to come back. But for now, this has been your boy, Edgy Gamer, Yo, and I wish you all... What's up, diggity dogs? You diggity dogs, have a wonderful night, and as always, later, losers. I'll see you bitches at Emo Whale Island. We've got Falling in Reverse, Blackfell Brides, and Three Days Grace coming. I'm going to lose my mind. <laughs>